So, I needed some new sport uh, mountain bike glasses and there's nobody local that carries them, the ones that I want to try on. So I found uh, Sport RX online and they seem like a very avid cycling style and all other sports, but cycling style glass company um, that will do prescription uh, sunglasses and sport glasses. So uh, they came today. So I'll do the unboxing real quick, try on a few, tell you what I think. And uh, yeah, hopefully it helps you out. All right, let's open this up. Hard to do one-handed, better not cut myself. Lots of paper. Ooh. What do we got here? We got uh, one set of Oakleys. Another set of Oakleys. We got some Rudy projects. And Rudy projects. Pretty sweet box. Ooh, real nice case. It's almost like a carbon fiber look. And uh, open it from the side. I'm guessing that's like magnetic. Yep, that's magnetic. And there's the first set. I can tell already, don't like these ones. I just pulled them out of the cold front porch so you can see them fogging up already. But uh, here's the first set. I am guessing those are going to be way too narrow for me. But I will try them on so you can laugh at me. Hey, these aren't as bad as I thought. Um, the lenses I'm going to pick are actually going to be transitional. Um, but uh, these are not horrible. I wanted a little more coverage though, so less wind comes around. But they fit good, feel good. Not bad for the first ones. All right, second one, Rudy Projects. Bigger box, much bigger box. Um, bigger case, different style case. I should be naming these off so you know what, uh, what style they are. I'll go back and do that. Um, here's what the second uh, Rudy Project glass um, frame that I'm going to try is. It's the Horus, I guess. Horus. Um, black graphite. Real cool, real cool case. I like that a lot. Um, a little better packaging on these, a little better. Uh... All right, the second Rudy Project. Horus, I guess they're called. Um, these also maybe are a little narrower than I thought than they looked online. Um, but these ones have a rubber section there for your nose and there's a screw so I'm assuming you can do different sizes in or in case that wears out. And not bad. Um, they come with this cool sticker right here. Not bad, not bad. I don't know, I don't love them. Um, I definitely don't love the look of them. Once again, not a ton of eye coverage. Um, similar to the Oakleys that I already have, but uh, oh, let me uh, throw a disclaimer out there as well. The only options I have because of the prescription I need um, are these few frames that we're gonna look at. Um, I've got one eye that needs a real thicker lens. Um, so a lot of the cool ones that uh, are out there, I don't get to pick from. So that's why these lens selections are pretty slim. Oh, well. All right, moving on to the first Oakley box. Um, this one, I believe, is called the Crosslink. Uh, let's check it out. A little tougher box to do with one hand for sure. Nice case, nice Oakley case. I've have, I actually have one of these for my other set. They are a nice durable. Um, case that you can't smush if you put it in the back of a backpack uh, or any of your cycling bags or anything. Nice case. Ooh, this is nicer than mine. Um, my Oakley uh, case is not foam fitted like this. These uh, This case is about set up perfect for this specific glass. 
um, frame, I should say. And it has the bag there stuffed in. And it looks like these are extra, extra arms um, in case you want to change the color because the uh, stack ones have some red in. I'm having trouble getting them out here. So it comes with, comes with these uh, side arms on them and then it actually has some spare built right into the case. So pretty slick. Right off the bat, I like these ones uh, better than the two previous Rudy projects. Uh, they're just a little more stylish, um, a little more height in the lens to get more eye coverage from wind, bugs, and twigs. Um, hang on a second here. It does have a nice uh, nose protection rubber there. I'm going to set them down and just kind of do the line up here. Um, you can tell that there's a little more coverage. This isn't a super professional display, but I wanted to show you guys the difference. Now to try them on. Um, they fit. I'd say they fit even better than the two Rudy projects so far. And as I was mentioning, more eye coverage. Um, these ones are clear. I'm going to get the transitionals. Um, so far, so good. I like the feel of these. They feel nice and light. That uh, I love them so far. Okay, last but not least, we've got the Crosslink. I guess it's another Crosslink. I forget exactly what the difference is here. Dude, get this box open quickly. Without ripping it because I'm gonna have to return them. Okay, so this is the Crosslink um, MNP. I should know what that means. I'm trying to think what the MNP uh, means, but uh, this is the second one, so it's the same style um, but just a different model. Uh, right off the bat, it does not have as nice of a nose piece compared to this one. This is more rubberized. A little more better fit. These uh, lenses do not seem like they're going to have as much coverage um, up and down, which we can try to line up here and see. You'll be able to tell just a little lower profile. These ones are a little higher profile. These ones are also the cross links, but they don't have the initials behind them. Um, let's see, I'll do a little spin around. All right, here's these ones. Um, not as much coverage up and down as I mentioned. I like the sides, they feel a little grippy, but definitely the nose piece is riding right on plastic. Um, I think these are more of like your daily daily wearers as well, not as much as the sport glass, or maybe you know you can use it for sport glass and for daily wearing. Maybe not with as much craziness going on the side, but. Um, don't love these ones as much. I'm going to try the other Oakley ones back on real quick. Yeah, these ones just fit better. Um, like I say, that's almost like a springy feel. You're not going to be able to tell, but uh, it's resting on that rubber piece, so I don't feel any plastic at all on my nose. And uh, they seem to fit pretty well. So there it is. You've got, uh, you know, turn them around. you got two Rudy projects. We've got two Rudy projects back here. Uh, once again, I didn't get to go with super stylish ones because of my prescription I need. They needed to be a little more like these. And then there's uh, two Oakley ones. Um, I think both this set and that Rudy project set were more so for daily wearing. Um, and then these were a little more sporty. There's the Oakleys. Um, cross, cross link and the other um, Rudy Project. My personal opinion for fit and feel and lightness is going to be this Oakley Crosslink. And just in case you're actually looking for the exact names of them, here we go, right there. Those Crosslink Fit, that's the ones that uh, I tried on twice and like a lot. 
And uh, once again, Sport RX is where this is from. So there you have it. I uh, am going to go with the Oakley Crosslink Fit. Um, this had a super lightweight feel to it. Nice rubberized nose. You barely felt like they were on you. And uh, a little more coverage this way. And they will take the higher prescription um, for somebody who needs that. And even if you don't, they're nice glasses. Um, if you don't need a higher prescription, you're cool and you got a lot more options than I had. So thanks for checking in. We'll see ya.